English speaking course. Hello, everyone. Welcome to English speaking course. In today's lesson, we will practice speaking skills in English together. We will give you some exercises. Try to answer out loud to improve your speaking skills. Now, let's get started. Part 1 Shadowing. In part 1, you will listen to a sample of a short conversation. In this shadowing lesson, you will hear a story, listen to the tone and the intonation, try to imitate and copy the native English speaker. Okay, it's time to give it a try. Amy, you won't believe where I stayed last night. Oh, where did you stay? At the Grand Luxe Hotel downtown. It was absolutely magnificent. No way. I've always dreamed of staying there. How did that happen? Well, my company had an event, and they booked a room for me. I felt like royalty. You lucky thing. Tell me everything. Was the bed as soft as they say? Oh my gosh, yes. I sank into it. And the sheets. They must have been made of clouds. I'm so jealous right now. What about the view? I had a room overlooking the city. The skyline at night was breathtaking. <gasps> that sounds amazing. Oh, and don't get me started on the bathroom. Marble everywhere and a bathtub that could fit three people. Three people? That's insane. Did you try any of the hotel services? I did. I went for a spa treatment. They had this amazing chocolate massage. Chocolate massage? That sounds heavenly. It was. And the breakfast buffet in the morning? To die for. You're making me so envious, Lisa. I need to find a reason to stay there. You should. It's a once-in-a-lifetime experience. I felt so pampered. Maybe for my birthday. I could splurge a bit. Definitely. And who knows, maybe you'll get an upgrade. You've convinced me. I'm going to look into booking a night there. You won't regret it. Just make sure to take lots of photos. Great job, everyone. So now, we turn to practice speaking by the duet method. I'll read my lines and you'll read your lines on the screen out loud. And then we switch. You can even pause the video to practice your lines. So now, here we go. Amy, you won't believe where I stayed last night. At the Grand Luxe Hotel downtown. It was absolutely magnificent. Well, my company had an event, and they booked a room for me. I felt like royalty. Oh my gosh, yes! I sank into it. And the sheets. They must have been made of clouds. I had a room overlooking the city. The skyline at night was breathtaking. Oh, and don't get me started on the bathroom. Marble everywhere and a bathtub that could fit three people.
I did. I went for a spa treatment. They had this amazing chocolate massage. It was. And the breakfast buffet in the morning? To die for. You should. It's a once-in-a-lifetime experience. I felt so pampered. Definitely. And who knows, maybe you'll get an upgrade. You won't regret it. Just make sure to take lots of photos. Oh, where did you stay? No way. I've always dreamed of staying there. How did that happen? You lucky thing. Tell me everything. Was the bed as soft as they say? I'm so jealous right now. What about the view? <gasps> that sounds amazing. Three people? That's insane! Did you try any of the hotel services? Chocolate massage? That sounds heavenly. You're making me so envious, Lisa. I need to find a reason to stay there. Maybe for my birthday. I could splurge a bit. You've convinced me. I'm going to look into booking a night there. Here is the vocabulary of the conversation above. Let's read and listen to the pronunciation of the word. Then try to read each word again with an example. 1. Downtown, meaning the main business section of a city. Example, at the Grand Lux Hotel downtown. 2. Book a room, meaning make a reservation or arrangement to secure accommodations in a hotel. Example, well, my company had an event and they booked a room for me. 3. Bathtub, meaning a large container for holding water in which a person can bathe. Example, marble everywhere and a bathtub that could fit three people. 4. Spa treatment, meaning health or beauty treatments using water, which might include a massage, sauna, or hot tub. Example, I did, I went for a spa treatment. 5. Breakfast buffet meaning 
a meal set out on a buffet or table for ready access and informal service, usually offered in hotels in the morning for breakfast. Example, and the breakfast buffet in the morning? To die for... So that's the end of today's lesson. You did really well. Remember, practice makes perfect. So try to practice speaking every day, okay? Goodbye. See you in the next videos. Don't forget to practice your English every day to improve your English level. Watch the video for one week. Try to think and speak in English every time. Listen and repeat the lesson out loud to improve your listening and speaking skills fast. Thanks for watching. Please give us a like, share, and comment. Click here for more useful videos.